Hi, this is CS Trades 101, the Wolf Pack. How's everybody doing here today? So, I just wanted to get into some stuff. Um, I've noticed across uh, all the social media platforms. Um, wow, man. Everybody's breaking, cracking, crying, pointing fingers. Wow, man. What happened there? Stock trading. Like, now it's, now it's a big uh, gong show here. We got Trades Trades crying up a storm about, oh, man, I'm not part of this. I'm not part of that. I just do my own thing. We got Teddy Zane going off on Lou. You're not this. You're not about shorts covering. We got Lou saying that this information about the shorts have already covered and on and on and on to stop buying shares. Wow. Okay. <clears throat> Holy crow. The only normal people on here are fucking <laughs> Jay Ingram and myself. Holy crow and Tony. Wow, man. Um, that's it's, it's gotten nuts. So, guys, I just wanted to get out here and just elaborate on some stuff. Okay, um, no, AMC is not dead. Far from dead. We're sitting in a better position than we have before, okay? This market pull down, I've discussed this six months ago. This is what, and I've discussed it two weeks ago. So if you follow me on my live chats, videos in the morning, um, market open every morning, we're here. You can come join the pack and we will discuss this stuff. I'll explain all this stuff to you, but I'm gonna explain a little bit of it um, on this live right now. So, um, no, the shorts haven't covered. Yes, and some some um, smaller firms have. In the UK, we followed them. Um, we've uh, found out what firms they are. They're small, they don't do, it doesn't do anything, okay? Um, they've just uh, executed their positions. Uh, it does nothing for the short squeeze, okay? So let's get that off the table. Um, <clears throat> the bottom line is, um, we do need some volume, but as I explained before, around Christmas time, we're going to have this pull. This market is going to, it's, I wouldn't call it a crash. A crash is going to be after this thing squeezes. Okay. It's going to drain the money from the market. It's going to start collapsing cryptos. This is what we want. Okay. This is exactly what we want. We want to see the crypto market start crashing. Okay. Because that means that the hedge funds are pulling money out of their other positions. That's why you guys are seeing all of these stocks crumble, okay? Because the short squeeze is coming, okay? If we didn't see any of this stuff happen, that's concerning, okay? So I've explained all this before. If you're on my channel, you guys totally understand. So we're gonna go through the basics of a short squeeze, okay? The short squeeze will most likely happen and most of them have happened in pre-market. You're gonna see about two hours before you're going to see a battle between institutions okay battling it out you're going to see a big upkick in price okay it's going to open market you're going to see some fomo some gamma kick in we're going to be getting 80 90 110 mark the shorts are going to shit their pants they're going to get scared okay bottom line it doesn't go any other way a short squeeze usually takes about a year okay so this is all factual information okay so um when it hits that high level up in the hundreds low low hundreds um bottom hundreds okay that tier okay that tier that is the fear tier okay that is going to get them to scramble they're going to try to close their positions they can't just close their positions that easy okay they have to cover their positions these things are hedged like two, four, five. To, it's we don't even know the the realm of it. It's it's so fucking complex, okay. So they gotta get fined, not just any shares. They gotta return back to the original owners of those shares. They're gonna want those shares back when this thing gets really out of control. You have to remember there's con there's interest in all this shit, lending fees, okay. They want those original shares. These shares are documented with a number that are registered with AMC um, financial branch, okay? You can check your shares to see if they're legit, okay? So that's what they do. Bottom line, it doesn't go any other way, okay? So the original owners of these shares are not gonna want synthetics, okay? Can we see what are th synthetics? No, we can't as retail investors. Can the banks? No, they can't, okay? Can brokers? Yes, they can. Institutions? Yes, they can, okay? So, yes, we do own the float. We own a majority of the float, okay? The numbers have changed a little bit, 
but um, as of the $70, we've gone down a little bit, but we're still about the 80% mark. Um, um, yes, some people did sell when it was at the 80, more than you think, but did it hurt us? No, it made it better because when these lower prices came down, we had more people enter into the market, okay, with AMC. It's got more publicity. Do these numbers matter? No, they don't. If it drops another $10, it doesn't matter because they have to find original shares to return. There's a problem with that, okay? These big institutions are holding these big shares. You are holding these shares. They can't just pick them out of the air. They can go ahead and grab synthetics. It don't cut it, okay? So if you want to get, find out more about this stuff, you know what to do. Join the pack because we got your back, okay? Over and out, CS Trades 101. See you guys in the morning pre-market.